Hello everyone. Well, today we're going to be repotting my lemon cypress cuttings or small trees. I got a couple nursery pots that I'm going to be using. It's a good idea to hold on to your used nursery pots just for times like this. I think these will be a good size to put them in. They're still not really overly big. I have to think about that when I'm bringing them in for the winter for space. But yet it's it allows me to slip these in there and give them a little bit more room to grow. and at least uh, stay alive and do well over the winter time. They will do a little bit of growing but not a lot. They did grow a little bit last winter but not a lot until I brought them outside last spring and they just really shot up. So I expect they'll be happier being in these larger pots. This one here is really deteriorating fast, so it's in desperate need of a, another pot anyways. Next spring, we will repot these into some proper bonsai soil and do some work on the trees at that time. I'm not going to go pulling the dirt away from the roots at this time. Instead, we're going to put the tree in the pot. And with a little bit of bonsai soil on the bottom, I'll put it in the pot and put some more bonsai soil around the outer diameter of this root ball. And we'll leave them like that for the winter time. We'll give the roots a little bit more room to grow. And hopefully they'll stay healthier through the winter. And here I just cut a whole piece of screen. And just put it on the bottom of the pot. You can see here it has many holes in the bottom. Most of these nursery pots have good drainage holes already in them which is good so it's just great for something like this uh, as far as the screen goes this is old used window screen they were replacing some windows at work so I ended up getting a couple pieces of some window screen and it works great for this type of thing so we're going to go ahead and put a little bit of soil in the bottom here a little better. I don't want it really sitting too high.
and that'll be good for now. Most of it got down the sides, but as a little time goes by and after a few waterings and it settles out, I can always put some more in. So this is how we're going to pot the other two up, is the same way, and then we'll give them a good watering, and I'll put them back out on the bench underneath my peach tree for at least another couple weeks, hopefully. On this cutting here that was in the pot that was falling apart and in really poor condition, you're able to see more of the roots. Some along the bottom and the sides. Pretty interesting. And here we go with the last one. You can see with this one here, this is the one that was in a smaller pot, so it's even got more room here for the roots to expand. This bonsai soil, because it's so dry and particle like it, it really flows down in, in the gaps really nicely. Well, here they are potted up for the winter time. Now we'll just give them a good soaking with water. And I'll put them back out on the small bench until it's ready to bring them back inside. Well, I think that's good for now. And here they are, back out on the bench where they really like it. To finish up maybe another couple weeks of nice early fall weather before we have to bring them inside. Well, that's it for today, guys. Have a great day.